Am I the asshole for telling my girlfriend a wedding was child free even though it wasn't? My girlfriend and I went to my sister's wedding last week and I told her it was child free even though it wasn't. Context My girlfriend has a kid. A little girl who's three yo and she takes her everywhere. We rarely have private moment as a couple. Now, don't get me wrong. I love my girlfriend's daughter. But it gets exhausting to never have moments between just me and my girlfriend. So, when I told my girlfriend about my sister's wedding, I told her that it was child free and I asked if she could have someone babysit her daughter. She asked her mom, who agreed. At the wedding, there was obviously children, a detail I'd forgotten. And when my girlfriend confusingly asked me why were there kids if it was a child-free wedding, I simply told her I had no idea. She went to the bathroom during the dinner but I noticed she wasn't coming back so I went to look for her and I encountered my sister who looked very angry. My sister called me an asshole and a coward. Apparently, she ran into my girlfriend who was upset with her because my GF thought my sister had only applied the child-free rule to her. She told my girlfriend that her wedding was never child-free, which made my girlfriend even madder. But at me. And she left. I called my girlfriend but she didn't answer it and when I came home her things and her daughters weren't there anymore. My sister is also not talking to me anymore because she thinks I threw her under the bus even. Though I never told my girlfriend it was my sister's idea to only apply the child free rule to her. I think I had a good reason to tell my girlfriend it was child free but having both my sister and Girlfriend mad at me is making me think otherwise. You're the asshole. And I agree with your sister. A total coward. You could have just said I'd really like a special night alone with just us two. Do you think your mom could watch your daughter for the night so we can connect? But instead you lied and manipulated. How did you think you wouldn't get caught in that lie? I don't think you have a GF anymore. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Yes. Your girlfriend jumped to the obvious conclusion that you'd been told the wedding was child free to exclude her daughter and went to your sister about it. How exactly else did you think this was going to end up? So now you've got a justifiably pissed off sister who had to handle your mess on her wedding day. And a GF who has learned you lie to her. You're the asshole. If you want to play childish games of lying instead communicating like an adult then expect to be treated like one. And by the way, my girlfriend has a kid. A little girl who's three yo and she takes her everywhere. At the wedding, there was obviously children. A detail I'd forgotten. This and the fact that you felt the need to ask if you were the R on Reddit makes me think your bulb is a bit dimmer than average. Wow. Massive you're the asshole. Your sister is right. You are an R and a coward. You could have just told your GF that you'd like a night out. Just the two of you. But no. You had to make her believe that her daughter wasn't allowed to go. Of course her three-year-old goes everywhere with her what did you think would happen? Dating a mom. I hope she dumps you. You're the asshole. And she left you. Dude. She's not your girlfriend anymore. You're the asshole for lying. For one. And showing you have zero respect for your hopefully ex-girlfriend. You're also an asshole for being in a relationship with a mother when you clearly don't want to be a father and don't even understand that children are not accessories or pets. WTF. She takes her everywhere. Like that's not what you're supposed to do with your young child.
You're also super terrible at critical thinking WTF did you think would happen when she got to the wedding and there were children there. You sound like a 15-year-old. Not a grown-ass adult. You're the asshole. I understand you wanted to spend time with your girlfriend alone but instead of just communicating that to her you fabricated an entire lie that backfired in your face. How hard is it to tell your girlfriend that you want a night with just the two of you? Without her baby? You're the asshole. You're the asshole you lied for no reason and we're easily found out. This is a situation entirely of your own making. I found a typo. This should read. My ex-girlfriend. Also. You're the asshole for lying. And since you played with fire. You got burned. You're the asshole. Communication is key. If you want some alone time with your girlfriend tell her. What you did was really in a whole move. You demonstrate that you are a selfish liar. Wow you're the asshole. She's right. You are a coward and you did throw your sister under the bus. For something she didn't even do. You threw blame and avoided a mature conversation with the person you were dating. What you did was super hurtful and not the way to go about dealing with an issue that you are having. Honestly. Don't expect her to come back. My sister is also not talking to me anymore because she thinks I threw her under the bus even. Though I never told my girlfriend it was my sister's idea. You're the asshole come on. Who else would choose child free except bride and groom? Asshole. You're the asshole. You done fucked up right good there buddy. Holy shit. When I came home her things and her daughters weren't there anymore. I love a happy ending. You're the asshole lying always makes you the R. Seriously. Dude. What did you honestly think was going to happen when you got to the wedding and your ex saw the other kids? You're the asshole she is right that you are a coward. Obviously when you date a woman with a three-year-old daughter you are going to have limited private time. That is common sense. If you feel like you need more, pull on your big boy pants and have a conversation. You chose to lie rather than talk to her so of course she doesn't have time for that bullshit. You also threw your sister under the bus so I completely understand why she is angry with you. You're the asshole. Not only did you lie you put your sister in a terrible place. Now, don't get me wrong. I love my girlfriend's daughter. But it gets exhausting to never have moments between just me and my girlfriend. Congrats. You don't have to worry about the kid cramping your life anymore. You don't love any of the females in your life do you? Hated the kid being around in her mom's life. Hated your GF for taking care of her young child but too cowardly to say it. Didn't care about your sister enough to care about whether you'd mess up her day at her wedding. You're the asshole glad she knows her worth. Fastest you're the asshole I've typed in a while. Dude. You're misreading having been broken up with as her being mad at you. She's probably got over being mad at you when she was packing. She will get mad all over again when you inevitably harass her. The harassment will be something you identify in your own mind as trying to reason with her. You lied. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Why didn't you just talk to your GF about having a night just the two of you? So instead of being an adult about it, you lie to her and wonder why she is upset with you. You're the asshole. You couldn't just say. Let's have a nice evening with my family and have some adult time and conversation at an adult event. Can you ask your mom if she can watch the little one? That's not that hard. How could you be so dumb to think that she would not see other kids there?